Hundreds of thousands of adults could get access to better health care starting December 1st. Governor Roy Cooper has set that as the tentative date for Medicaid expansion to begin, even though the budget bill triggering the launch still hasn't taken effect. WECT's Ava Brengord has more on the announcement made today by the governor and the DHHS secretary. Uh, Ava, Roy Cooper has pushed for expansion of Medicaid since he first got elected as governor. He has, John, and once it takes effect, it has the potential to cover 600,000 adults in North Carolina who did not previously qualify for coverage. They either made too much money to qualify for traditional Medicaid services or too little to get health insurance coverage. The expansion will include adults ages 19 to 64 who have incomes up to 138% of the federal poverty level. To break it down, an individual earning around $20,000 a year will now qualify along with a family of three earning around $34,000 a year. The expansion will cover services like yearly checkups, hospital stays, maternity care, and vision and hearing, all at little to no cost. Governor Cooper says the delay on lawmakers passing a state budget pushed back the start of the program, but work has gone on behind the scenes to get the state ready for the expansion. This has been an unnecessarily long and agonizing journey for many North Carolinians. But today, the hope that has stirred in so many across our state will become a reality. Today, we finally know the date of the start of life-saving health care for North Carolinians. Now, up to 300,000 people could be enrolled automatically on December 1st, and we've made it easy for you to check if you're eligible and see how you can apply. Just check this story on our website for links to the state site. John? All right, Ava, thanks for the story. Now, here's